All right, guys. Now we're gonna do problem twelve uh, three. An elevator an elevator descends from rest with an acceleration of five feet per second square until it achieves a velocity of fifteen feet per second. Determine the time required and the distance traveled. Okay. Again, we're gonna use the laws of kinematics. And first we're going to write down what we have and what do we have. We have that the acceleration is equal to 5 feet per second square. We have that the uh, starting velocity is 0 because it says right here from rest. We got that the velocity uh, achieved is 15 feet per second. And we got that the starting position we're going to say is 0 because it's not uh, otherwise specified. Let me see if I can do a quick little drawing. An elevator descends from rest. Let's say this is the elevator. And it's going to descend from rest. And let's say this is 0 and this is the distance that it's going to travel. And of course at what time is it going to achieve distance. So we're looking for S and T. Alright, let's get to it. Now formula that we know is that V equals V naught plus A times T from the loss of kinematics at the back of your book. Just plug in the numbers equals to 0 plus 5t and you get that t is equal to 3 seconds always put your units so now that we got the time we can use this other kinematic formula which says that v square is equal to v naught square plus 2 times a times s minus s naught all you gotta do is plug in the numbers again. 15 squared is equal to 0 squared plus 2 times 5 times s minus 0. And we're looking for s. s is gonna come out to be 22.5 feet. Always put your units. And there you go. Those are the final answers.